Who is Australia's most repulsive cultural icon? <laughs> Despite her recent stunt in Parliament, it's not Pauline Hanson. <laughs> Cane toads cover 1.2 million square kilometres of northern Australia and their poison kills some of our precious native species. Current control measures like physical removal are just a band-aid solution. So a game of cane toad golf on your next trip to North Queensland is unlikely to solve the problem. We need a better control measure for this highly adaptive pest. A virus could be the solution. Viruses can be great at biocontrol. On two occasions, the European rabbit population was reduced by 85% with viral release, showing how successful this can be. But choosing the perfect virus is no easy feat. Scientists have tried to engineer a cane toad virus for biocontrol, but they hit a roadblock when they found that it could infect our native amphibians. So how can we find new candidate toad viruses to be tested? My research interests and the key to solving this problem lies in the DNA of the toad itself. You might not be aware that the DNA of every animal, including 5% of your own DNA, that's one and a half million base pairs, consists of ancient fragments of viruses. These viruses integrate occasionally during infection and then can sometimes be passed to offspring. This means that the DNA of every animal is like a catalogue of past infection, which gives us an insight into the kind of viruses encountered by these animals' ancestors. We hypothesise that this was also true of the cane toad, and having a look through its DNA could give us an idea of what kind of viruses might currently be circulating. To accomplish this task, we first sequence the 2.2 billion base pair cane toad genome. To search through this data, we required a computational approach that told us about regions of the genome that looked like viruses. I've discovered a new family of viruses never before found in cane toads. Circoviruses are a causative agent of disease in pigs and birds, but the pathological potential in the cane toad is not known. We're currently trying to isolate this virus from wild toads to give us a potential new weapon in the toad battle. Although I can propose a solution to the cane toad problem, I'm not so sure what we can do about Pauline's behavior. Thank you very much.